Hey, good morning. Fancy meeting you here on the cycle path. <laughs> How are we doing out there? We're doing all right? I hope so. So we're here in the city of Yorba Linda, California, and we're going to ride the El Cajon bike trail. Done this trail many of a time. It's an awesome trail. All kinds of scenery. So, uh, Let's hit the ground running. Let's saddle up, folks. All right. Beware of coyotes. Oh. It's a little cloudy out, but I think the sun's going to burn that off I think it's just a marine layer you can see some uh, some blue uh. all right good morning Good morning. Good morning. All right. Good morning. Yeah, so this is a pretty cool trail. Like I said, I've ridden it many of a time. People are always respectful and kind. I like that. I like that. Then again, uh, they are pretty much on the hollow trails I go on. Gotta slow her down. Believe it or not, those uh, those crushed up leaves there, they get slippery and you'll, uh, you'll take a spill if you don't slow it down. <laughs> seen it happen, never happened to me, but I have seen it happen. Alrighty then. Now, right in front of us is uh, the Richard Nixon Museum. I think it's his birthplace. We'll stop there real quick and have a little look-see. See the helicopter in front of us. Uh, there we go. Uh, This is pretty cool. And I like this. There's the house right there, his birthplace where he was born. I guess he was actually born in the house. Huh. But I guess that was not unusual for back then. I think, uh, when was uh, President Nixon born? Probably in the 20s. So yeah, I was pretty common for people to be born at home with the midwife let's uh let's grab a couple of uh, close-ups shall we yeah that's pretty cool eh I think the helicopters when uh, when the presidents have them I know the plane is Air Force One. I think the helicopter is referred to as Air Force Two. 
I'm not really sure. I may have just seen that in a movie. <laughs> so don't take my word for it. But I think it might be a, it might be the case. Yeah, there's his home right there. Or his birthplace, I should say. I'm sure uh, in his latter years, he had something a little bit more extravagant than that humble little place there. Pretty cool though. Pretty cool. Has anyone been to this uh, museum? I have not actually been in the museum, but like I've said, I've been here many of a time. The museum is actually right there. There's the building. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, you can see it. So yeah, that's the uh, Richard M. Nixon birthplace slash museum. Let's get back on our ride, shall we? Alrighty, back on the bike. Let's get back on this trail here. I don't know why it is, but uh, every time I come on this path, I always stop at that museum. I don't know why. <laughs> I never go in the museum, but I always stop and look at the house and the helicopter. But you gotta admit, it is pretty cool. <laughs> We're gonna be coming up to a park here in a second. There's the, uh, it's right here where the Boy Scout uh, club thing is. I don't know what it is, like the clubhouse, I guess. Right there to our, to our left, that red building. But anyways, after this park, we're gonna get into some neighborhoods that I think is um, pretty fun. Because a lot of the houses, well, some of the houses, they have uh, animals, farm animals. So uh, I think that's kind of cool. By the way, that uh, that Boy Scout clubhouse, I think that was built in 1916, which would be what 106 years. Dang, that's a long time. I didn't realize the uh, Boy Scouts were that old. Valley View Avenue.
So that's Sam. Morning. There we go, right there. There we go. We got some farm animals here. Is that a rooster? It's a rooster. Yeah. How you doing? What's your name? Tom Rooster? Good morning. Yeah, a couple of ducks. Hey, duck. How you doing? Quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack. Let's see, we got some chickens back there as well. What's going on there, buddy? Hmm? There they go. See their feathers? They're all fuzzy. Like they're brand new chickens. <laughs> Alright, that was a cool little pit stop there. See all the little chickens and the ducks. I think there's a couple of other houses around here that uh, they have some farm animals. Nope. Good morning. Good morning. There's a couple of horses right there. To the right of us. Hey, horse. And a doggy. Hey, horse. Boogity, boogity, boogity. How you doing, buddy? What's your name? Sugar Cube? Huh? <laughs> All righty then. I won't disturb you. See you later, horse. There's gonna be a house on the right side of us. It's, uh, good morning. Named after some pigs, I think it is. What's that say? Please don't feed the horse. More chickens. More chickens. Yeah, it had a strange name after some pigs or something like that. <laughs> Can't remember. Let me see. There it is. Jasmine, Oliver, and Ernie Biscuit the pig. There's a the pig right there. One of them. Oh look at there's one of them Shetland horses right there. Look at that. Hey Biscuit, are you Biscuit? <laughs> cool you know what I find so uh, strange about the uh, the Shetland Pony it's a small little horse that's a Scottish breed and the Scots are kind of a tall people <laughs> isn't that kind of ironic <laughs> okay <laughs> I guess they uh, <laughs> they bred those horses for a reason. I don't know. No, I think it's just funny. <laughs> okay, Rose Drive. This one is this street is kind of busy. Not today though. All right. Well, 
we cleared that one. Oh, look at that. That marina there is just burning off quite nicely. That means it's going to be a wonderful day. Well, a clear day. But we'll hope for a wonderful day. Yes? I do believe this is the end of the line. Passengery. Alrighty. Well, that's going to do for me, folks. Thanks for hanging out with me. And we'll see you the next time on the Cycle Path. Yeah! Woo!